Hi, my name is Travis Torme. Today I'm going to talk to you about one of the ways I help my clients deal with marijuana charges in New Jersey. It's called the Pre-Trial Intervention Program. If you're accepted into the program and you complete it, the charges will be dismissed and your slate will be wiped clean. PTI is a diversionary program for first time offenders. You can not have any criminal record. You've never been convicted of a, of a criminal offense in this state or any other state. And you've never used a diversionary program before like PTI or a conditional discharge. If you've used one of those programs before, you're not eligible to use it again. Now here's actually what's gonna happen if you're accepted into the pretrial intervention program. They put you on probation for a one year period at a minimum potentially two years, potentially three years. Uh, as long as you stay out of trouble while you're on probation, they will dismiss the charges at the end of your probationary period. You will have no record. Stay out of trouble means you can't get arrested for any other offenses. They can drug test you, complete any community service that is required, and do everything that PTI requires. And if you successfully complete the probationary program, the charges will be dismissed at the end of your probation. You will have no record. However, there is a record of your arrest. Six months after you finish your PTI and you successfully complete PTI and the charges are dismissed, you can file for an expungement to have the arrest removed from your record. To apply for PTI, it's a $75 application fee. You apply at the uh, criminal intake division at the Superior Court in the county. You will be interviewed by probation. They will take some basic information from you, your name, address, uh, where you work, who you live with, if you have any prior record, you're not supposed to have any prior record to be eligible for PTI. And then we'll get some information about the charges that you are facing. Probation will then make a recommendation to the prosecutor's office about whether or not they think you are a good candidate for PTI. If you are recommended by probation, this is only the first step in the process. The next step is the prosecutor's office has to also agree with that recommendation and recommend you to be placed into the program. One of the best ways to actually get recommended for the pretrial intervention program is to get a good lawyer. Getting a lawyer shows that you're taking the charges seriously and that you're being proactive in dealing with your defense. Also, as an experienced criminal attorney, we often have relationships with the probation officers and the prosecutor, and we can convince them to recommend you for the PTI program. So if the probation department recommends you and the prosecutor's office recommends you, you are considered a good candidate for PTI and you will be placed into the PTI program. You have to do this on the record in Superior Court. You will go before a Superior Court judge. They will sign an order of suspension, suspending your charges during the period of your probation. The charges are frozen. They will show up as pending on your background check. If you successfully complete PTI, the charges will then be dismissed at the end of your probation. You will have no record. If you'd like to get some information on the other diversionary program in New Jersey, known as the Conditional Discharge, you can click the link below. I also have five links on how I typically challenge marijuana offenses. You can click any of those links to get my contact information. I'm happy to talk to you nights, weekends. You can call my office or email me. My website is criminallawyerinnj.com.